Good morning everyone and welcome to my Nashville vlog. It's Thursday morning. I just got out of the shower. I'm going to leave for the airport pretty soon. Um, I'll show you guys what I'm wearing. I got a lot of new stuff from Misguided. I did a little haul in my last vlog. If you guys didn't see, go watch it. But um, this set is like so comfy. I somehow got the pants too big. I wish that I would have gone down a size because they're definitely going to like stretch out and be baggy I think throughout the day. Um, hopefully when I wash them, they'll shrink. I guess we'll see. But this set is so comfy. It looks like it's pajamas. It's not. This coat is also misguided. My Yeezys. This is my carry-on. It's my Fendi in this bag, so I don't have too much on me. Because I actually hate flying when I'm carrying so much stuff. It's just so annoying. But yeah, I'm really excited. I'm going until Monday to go record for my podcast. Yeah, I love you so much podcast. If you guys have not listened or downloaded or whatever you do with podcasts, you guys need to. I love you so much. Takes Nashville. Very exciting. Keaton gets there tomorrow, which I'm really excited for. I have one recording tonight. And then I don't know what the plans are. Honestly, we normally have a lot more structure to our trips than we do this one, but it's going to be super fun. I'm so excited. I've been looking forward to this for so freaking long. So yeah, I'm pumped. Um, I'm going to link everything that I'm wearing down below as well. If you guys are new here, subscribe. Follow me on Instagram because I'll post a bunch of photos from the trip and everything. And yeah. Guys, I am so obsessed with the song. It is so good. Thank you. Big Nashville I girl. Forgotten it. This is where the security is like trying to get us to leave. They're I know. Staring at us, so we should it's go. Okay. But you're getting you're Thank going you. to Nashville where the TV show is. Oh yeah, I know. Okay. Wow, what a star. Thank you. What an outfit. Thank you. I love Oh my gosh, guys, I am kind of a mess right now. I'm trying to hold everything. Um, I just dropped off my luggage at my Airbnb host's like garage drop-off thing because I can't check in until 4. Keaton doesn't get here till tomorrow. I have a recording at 5. This jacket is just coming off right now. Okay, so never mind. Anyways, this jacket came off. Um, this, com this outfit is so comfy. I should have gotten a size down though, so I think I actually might order it again. That's how much I love it. Anyways, I'm about to get picked up by... A driver and then I'm gonna go to the Thompson Hotel and get some work done. I have my bag here I have a lot of work I need to do even like later tonight. This is technically a work trip like I'm recording but Keaton's coming So it's gonna be really fun. Um, but yeah, anyway, so I'm about to get picked up Okay guys, I just got on my lift. I just checked my Airbnb is literally behind there It's not too far to get my stuff. But anyways, I'm going to go do some work in the Thompson Apparently the lobby there is like amazing to work in So yeah All right, guys, so I spent the afternoon getting some work done. Um, just some like a cute little hotel lobby cafe thing. It was actually really nice. I got a lot done. I have barely even been in Nashville and I already just love it. Like I literally have seen barely anything. I got off the plane and I was like, I just love it here. So also everyone is so nice, which I really appreciate because obviously like growing up in Texas, people are really nice, but it's a little bit more like country twangy here, which I personally love. And all of my Lyft drivers so far have been so unbelievably nice. Like, oh my gosh, I just love them. Anyways, I'm gonna give you a little tour of our Airbnb. So I'm gonna give you guys a tour. Um, I haven't even really looked at it. I literally just set my stuff down, but, and look at people outside of this place were helping me. Like everyone's just so nice. Okay, so you walk in. I don't know what this would normally be. Um, and then, here we are, we're staying in the Gulch, which is like a really popular area of Nashville. Um, so it's a one bed, one and a half bath. I don't even know how to turn the lights on. Here's the closet. I will be hanging some stuff up. Very cool, very big bed. Here we are. Then you walk through here. Oh, here's the bathroom. Awesome, I need to turn the lights on. Um, and then you walk out here and we are back to the main living area. That is Urban Outfitters. And then there's like a bunch of stuff that's just really popular. Like, like I was literally just around the corner when I was working before. And then here is just our little main living area we have a little kitchen a fridge it's a great size very cute i'm a big fan guys i need coffee so bad this is legit so embarrassing but i actually don't know how to use one of these coffee machines so 
We have coffee supplies up here. My mom has one of these at the lake house currently and I'm like, I literally no clue. So I think I'm gonna try to figure out, this is so embarrassing, like I'm well aware. Um, I have to try to figure this out. Okay, so I'm gonna at some point try to figure this out. I wanna get this set up. Um, oh my gosh, I forgot to tell you guys. Kenzie from Delight Ministries, the lighting is so much better, um, is coming over in 30 minutes. They have the For the Girl podcast, Mac and Ken's, which is funny because I'm also a both. I'm Kenzie technically, but anyways, one of them, I say the same name every time. One of them is out of town, so one of them is coming over and we're gonna record for my podcast. Eventually, we are gonna record for their podcast. Um, I've recently started listening and using the tent and all that. I've told you guys a little bit about that, I think, at least in my stories. But yeah, I'm really excited for this episode. For those of you guys who want me to do a lot more like faith-based stuff, um, I'm not gonna be like a Christian influencer <laughs> necessarily, but um, obviously that's like a huge part of my life. So for those of you who have really wanted like more faith-based stuff, this episode will probably be more about that. However, if you don't want that, there are still so many other episodes that are not about that. I'm like kind of in a weird, I feel like I'm like in an alternate reality right now. I don't feel like, I don't know why I feel so weird. So we're gonna try to figure this out because it's literally just so embarrassing. Mr. Update guys, With the snap -tied this lid. is what I'm just doing. Look at me go. Guys, I just ordered DoorDash. It is 8.37. I recorded. Oh my gosh, the lighting back in this room is not the best, but today has been crazy. Like, so much stuff. So Keaton's flight got canceled just like randomly. And then um, she was supposed to land originally at 7 a.m. tomorrow. Now she's landing at 1 p.m. tomorrow, which is fine. But a few of my recordings kind of like got switched around and stuff. So I'm now recording with Sarah in the morning, which like works out really well because I could have just had like a nice tomorrow was gonna be my one day without recording. It works out really well because now we can like get breakfast tomorrow and then record and then Keen will get here. And then from then on, like we'll, you know, do our Nashville things, which will be really fun. So, um, I recorded with Kenzie of Delight tonight, which was really fun. Um, yeah, that one's just like really exciting and just something I really wanted to do. Guys, if you knew how much I was struggling to vlog right now, you would just laugh at me. Um, anyways, that was really fun. It was cool to kind of talk about like, I don't know. It, I think it's like good for people, even if you're like not someone with faith at all, because it was interesting to hear like their structure and like starting it from college. I keep having these people on by accident, honestly, that start businesses like straight out of college. Which is just interesting because I feel like that's just like not the norm. But anyways, it gets here at 1 p.m. now tomorrow. She lands at 1. We're not too far from the airport. Um, I'm gonna go to Milk and Honey in the morning with Sarah. Then we're gonna record. And anyways, this week I'm recording with Blair Fowler also. Iconic guys absolutely iconic literally she pioneered the YouTube space basically um, Megan and Liz I'm sure Keaton and I will record I'm recording with Hannah Ashton, which I've really wanted to record with her for so long um, Who else am I? I feel like I'm leaving someone out. No, because I said Sarah so in total it's six episodes, which is good But yeah guys, I'm just really Relaxing having a nice night in you actually need to finish some work on my computer And then I'm gonna watch Twilight because I randomly thought about that on the plane and I was like that sounds actually incredible so Good morning everyone, I'm literally watching Keaton's vlog right now. I'm uploading a vlog of mine, but I'm actually gonna have to head out to get breakfast, so I think I'll have to finish this when I get back. Good morning everyone. I need to fix my lip gloss. My hair is a little bit wild. I don't have like my products and stuff, so we're just gonna have to deal with it. Happy Friday guys. Um, I am about to head off to breakfast with Sarah Bell. I am so excited. Last night, guys, we were literally texting for like four hours straight just about so many random things and then we were both watching this one video oh my gosh why am i forgetting the channel i'll ask her i think white underbellies or something like that and basically it's crazy it's so interesting i'm pretty sure he just films off of skid row but it's about all these people's like life stories and like drug addiction and just like all these crazy things so anyways we randomly got on some topic and then she's like oh my gosh you have to watch this this is like what this whole channel is about and then there's a video and it's literally leonardo it's literally leonardo dicaprio's stepbrother it's wild and he's a fentanyl addict but i think his name was anyways um it is about to be it's almost 10 i am up and ready for the day i read this morning and then i got ready and we we're about to go to milk and honey for breakfast which i realize is actually walking distance for me which is 
awesome. So I'm gonna go on a nice little walk and then meet Sarah for breakfast. And then after we're gonna record our podcast and then around that time, um, Keaton should be back. So um, Keaton and I are also actually filming this weekend and the lighting right here is great now that I'm thinking about it. So this is what we're gonna have to film. Honestly, I'm like wondering if we'll end up doing that tonight or something, but who knows. I'm wearing this MAC lip gloss that I love that I just literally lost in another bag. <laughs> And then I need to put on something else that's like glossier. Zipper fell off this bag again, which is so annoying. So I keep my wallet back here now. You guys know, you know. Okay, now I feel more myself. Um, oh, I'm wearing my cute little puffer. This trip, I mainly am wearing misguided because I just got a bunch of stuff from them. I've just been a misguided gal lately. So this is, oh wait, I need to put the bag on underneath. Oops, this is my outfit for the morning. It's probably like one of my more casual outfits. Um, but yeah, it's a little bit colder in Nashville yesterday. It was 75, but the high for the next few days is 58 and it's supposed to rain a lot. So I guess we'll see, but guys, I found a mirror in our Airbnb and I moved it out to have actual good lighting. So my mirror pictures can continue. All right, guys, I'm listening to gals on the go. I'm about to head out. We're going to a really cute place that a lot of you guys have recommended to me. I'm really excited. Oh, I didn't even show you guys my outfit, really. Or yes, I did. Okay, misguided, misguided, Levi's, Nikes. I need to get new Air Forces. These are just trash. It's actually embarrassing. My normal bag. Um, I'm gonna do an Instagram post at the end of this weekend linking like all of my outfits, but I'll also have them linked down below. It just depends on, do you guys shop more on Instagram or do you shop more on YouTube? You know, I don't know what's best. My rings are literally Amazon jewelry. I have them linked on like every single like to know it post because I wear them every day. They're so cheap and I get the most compliments on it. Like my earrings are Jennifer Fisher and I get more compliments on my Amazon rings. So anyways, I'm gonna head out now and I'm so excited to see Sarah, oh my gosh. We made it to Mug and Honey. I'm with Sarah. We're just catching up. Um, I got the grain bowl, I think. I don't know, guys. I'm literally so out of it. I just drink, like, this is four shots of espresso, and that still is not really helping me. So that's great. Keaton is here. She's just trying on her. Oh my god. Oh. Also, just FYI, I bought this for this trip. Oh my gosh. We, so that we can take a photo like this. I have not even talked about the fact that this whole corona thing has been going on. I think that's in partly why I've been like, I, this trip, honestly, God, guys, has been the weirdest trip of my life. Like, it has just been so weird. So Sarah and I just recorded. I was with Sarah all morning and that was really fun. But just like everything, like so many things. My chest is just like yeah. heavy. Like it's, I don't know. Like I just feel weird. It's really crazy. And... Yeah, so basically we've had this trip planned for like a while yeah, and months. we obviously asked a ton of people blah 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 and it's like we're not going on like so obviously like we're trying my stepmom is a doctor and she's in Dallas and she actually just had I hope that the government doesn't come after me for this um just kidding I just like don't know what I can say and like what's whatever what's um yeah like what's appropriate but um she we are keeping up to date with the news and doing our best with everything, um, but she had four patients in Dallas test positive yesterday, which is crazy because I don't think it's even on the news. Like, I'm it's just that one place. Th okay, this is just what I don't understand. Like, there's so many things. Like, everyone's giving us such mixed information. Like, I'm just so confused. And obviously, like, we are, I am hand sanitizer, everything, so much stuff. Well, um, I find them in the store, you know. Yeah. I think they would also have <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. Well, my hand sanitizer, they were out everywhere near me. Quentin just gave me his. Yeah. yeah, so, and then, yeah, there's just been, like, a whole thing. So, we are really just trying our best here, people, in staying very clean and doing our best. Um, my Siri is on for some reason. Oh, my gosh, my family group chat. <gasps> just got the call that McKinney ISD is shut down next week. Yeah. Oh so, this is what, okay, so... Like, Keaton's school obviously is online. Now her mom's just, like, just come back for, like, from Nashville instead of going back to Arizona. But, yeah, it's really, really just something. Also, here's the thing. Like, Corona, I feel like, wasn't taken being taken as seriously until, like, we're basically in Nashville. Like, all of a sudden, everyone's, like, actually freaking out about it. And before, everyone was, like, making jokes about it, which is, like, you know, kind of messed up, I guess. So... We are trying our absolute best, and it's really something. Guys, 
Keaton and I always joke that we're the exact same person. I want you to pull out your yeah. phone really quick. Your screensaver. You're a liar. <laughs> no, I'm literally. Oh my god. Kenzie. No, we're literally the exact same this person. This is the exact same photo. <laughs> Oh All right, so anyways, um, so here we sad. are. We are really just thriving I now. Like, what is she about to say right now? We would have, it's literally the exact, literally the exact identical, same. just yeah. with different people. That's great. Yeah, it's always like that, guys. Oh, Lord. Yates, Missy Morgan. Guys, we are on our way. We're walking in, finally getting food. Oh, there's a way. We made it to lunch. I got a sandwich that I'm just not hungry enough to eat, so we'll see. Um, we have some spinach dip, tacos, just catching up. Let's put our bracelets. Oh yeah, my bracelet's on the counter. I need you to put it on me. This, our um, bracelet. I, I figured always... out a trick putting it on, because oh, you can't you put it on yourself, can you? No. I literally learned it. I need to show you this. Wait, maybe I do. Okay, I do put it on myself, though. You can? But Okay, but I just put I it couldn't. on, and then I like do it with one hand, basically, kind of. Oh, I do it with my teeth. Oh. I hold the like. I'll okay, I'll later, have to start. Well, obviously like, it's not really working well for me though, because it's not. Yeah, I'm just not I on. Will do it for yeah. You. Okay, Keaton and I are at Urban, and we just decided we're filming a mukbang. Should we just do that all tonight? I feel like we can. Yeah, let's well, just we'll do, do it. We'll do it like later tonight. Yes. It's, it's like five. And we are just eight lunch. Like six or seven. Or something. Yeah. So we're gonna um film and do our content night tonight, guys, and then really go out in the town tomorrow. Anyways, we decided that we need matching crew necks because we're actually so annoying. Or like matching something for a video. We need another one. Yeah, no, Keaton has all I of them. Do. I, I always need another. The or there's this one that has purple. Well, I only like this one because it has white. Yeah, cute. And that's cute. It's this me one. wearing white in a mukbang is embarrassing because it's going to oh, end up okay, like this. So no, but not. we should do it still. It's fine. Are you sure? Yeah, it's fine. It's one size fits all. So let's cute. Size. Nice okay, little. one second. Keaton. Make sure that we pan the camera. So cute. Oh, I love this. Yeah, this is cute. Wow. I can't tell. It's a really good angle. Yes. Wow. <laughs> okay, yeah, we're doing that. I need this. Okay, <laughs> Keaton, you need to understand how funny this was. Hi, guys. Oh. Okay, so we were talking about how much we love Lip Addict lip gloss just now. And... I was at the, I already got it because I get it from like gifting yeah. or whatever, but I was at the Mayfair uh, oh, was gifting house, house thing and yeah. I was talking to Sam and then she's like, oh my gosh, have you tried this yet? Like we've sent this to you, right? And I look over, she's like, oh my gosh, Keaton loves it. Like obviously <laughs> she knows and I look over and it's literally just a printed photo. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, literally. I was like, oh yeah. my gosh. Yeah. yeah, I literally, Sam lip addict, this is so it's hard. It's so good. And like, I, I didn't realize it was $50 I, each. I had no such idea. such an expensive look. Yeah. Class, and I'm addicted to it. No and wonder. I didn't realize until like, I was like halfway through a tube and I was like, I actually don't think I've ever finished a lip gloss in my life. Yeah. Like, I don't really do it like that, but like, I'm literally applying it. Like, I apply it before bed. You know? <laughs> For people who have not really left the Airbnb much. We? We really. Okay, well here's, okay, guys. It's okay. It's like, it's just a summer party. It's just in a different yeah, state. Yeah, we're just having a summer party in a different state. Look at it that way. Also, we're ordering currently right now this no-baked cookie dough. We're both vlogging, so I'll pan to camera two in a sec. Don't worry. <laughs> <laughs> but you can't even really see on here. Here you guys go. Um, we we've got six flavors. Dough. We're ordering cookie dough, and we ordered five guys. I don't know why I'm sitting like, right here. Are you? Okay, here's the thing, Keen. Okay, I think like I think he's here. It says they will meet you outside. No, 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 no. No, 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 no. We can't go outside. I can't go outside. Okay, so here's also, his name is Jesus. So <laughs> Jesus is coming to save us. Jesus is coming to save us. It literally just says Jesus. It makes us feel better. Yeah, that's why we're like. That. So that's he's our friend. Happening. He's yes, really coming he's right now. Coming to deliver the burgers. I've had something in my eye all day long, which is like not good. Also, when it's you're... kind of like red on the side. Like it's like irritating. I think it's because I always have because you keep like touching it. But I'm like, I hope that's not. No, it's from it's my. Irritated. It happens to me all the time. I constantly have eye issues. So here's the thing. Like we could film tonight, or we could film tomorrow or Sunday. And if we film tomorrow or Sunday, we could do it when there's good lighting. That's true. I feel like tonight's like our first night. We need to like chill, just chill and eat and like, yeah, I agree. And we need to have like a better meal for the thing. Yeah, you know. Yeah, we have to try something Nashville. I think, right or no? No, we don't. 
I don't know what's near here, but we could try something like a restaurant that like we have to find something that's been recommended and, and not like show. get it to go. And maybe we can like just I can set up post me because post me options are limited. I think he's here. Guys, we're just gonna eat, have a great time. Um, okay, I really want us to watch this YouTube ch channel. That dang it, I, I told you guys that I would find remember the name. Sarah and I were talking about it for forever earlier. Oh, the one with yeah, Leonardo yeah. DiCaprio's stepbrother. Let's, yeah, let's do that. Okay, so there's like other ones that are really good that we have to watch, and I need to put my phone in the phone charger. And honestly, I want to wash my face. Yeah, and because get if it comfy. gets too late, then I'm gonna be upset that I still have this makeup on. I watched your He's vlog outside, like this morning, morning and I saw that you did it, so I, you must have been very tired that one night when I you was. didn't do it. I was really concerned for you. I was so and you tired. also like you were for sure sober because when were you not? So like, I know. And that's why I was got like home and I was like, it's just not happening, and like that never happens. But good night, like <laughs> good night, guys. Keaton and I. I'm glad that we're here to talk about this now. We were talking about this. Keaton thought thought that it would be a good topic for us to kind of touch on, and oh like everyone God. goes through their like, like. Wait, I think I have to go outside, again. I'll go with you, but you can't lock the. This conversation will be continued. At we time. we have to come back and continue, but we'll like, be it back. Hasn't yeah, come we'll be up. back. <laughs> She just goes, we're going out to the door because we think we have to like leave, leave. And Keaton <laughs> opens the door and our DoorDash guy is standing right there and she like jumps. I'm like, not kidding, my heart is in <laughs> my bubble. It literally felt, I, mean, I literally got so shook. He was just standing there. He literally didn't even knock. He was like this. <laughs> he just laughed. Okay. Jesus. I think that we can't hear. Oh my gosh, that was Jesus. I think that we can't hear the knocks because my DoorDash person yesterday said they've been knocking and I didn't hear it at all. Really? So I, I and he messaged us because I'm like. Yeah. <laughs> and my friend who came over and recorded last night said the same thing. So, so that must weird. be it. That? That is weird. Actually, I'm <laughs> shook. And yeah. I felt so bad for him because he was standing there like. <laughs> he just like laughed and was like, okay, bye. Okay guys, our food is here. We just door dashed some of this cute cookie dough. I got like a small cheeseburger and some fries. I really wanted a milkshake to dip the fries in, which is why I got that, but there are no milkshakes available right now. So we have five guys and then um, the cookie dough is on the way, which sounds really amazing. This is the perfect guys, size, I think. I know, this is the perfect size. So we got cookie dough from No Baked Cookie Dough. Oh, wow. We ordered it on DoorDash, link below for credit. We're watching some YouTube videos. We got sucked in the Trisha Paytas hole. And then we're gonna, I'm gonna show you some videos that you're gonna be obsessed with. We so we are learning lots. We are learning a lot here in Nashville. Really excited for this cookie dough, guys. Like, it looks so cute. Good morning, everyone. Um, Keen and I just realized that I showered, dried my hair, curled my hair, did my makeup and got dressed in 32 minutes. Uh, it's all made possible by my Dyson hair dryer, truly. Yeah, so we are actually leaving the Airbnb. Um, it's really gloomy out. Keaton and I, um, just gonna make a disclaimer. We know that we're in Nashville and we have just really stayed in the Airbnb. Um, one, we are gonna leave, but also we were like, honestly, like even if we just like hang out in the Airbnb all weekend, like we will have fun. We are not the kind of people who like, have to be entertained at all times. Um, also, a lot of things are closed, so like the Country Museum, whatever, why can't I, Hall of oh, Fame. It's raining now. We need umbrellas, kids. Oh my gosh, see this is what we don't need. Like, this is what we can't leave our kids This is why we can't leave our Airbnb, guys. But um, yeah, a lot of things are obviously closed because of Corona, which like obviously makes sense, which is like not a huge deal at all. Um, so we're just gonna go. We were, I mean, we're gonna go in 12 South and shop and stuff. It's just pouring, guys. Look at this. That is really just tragic right now. But, anyways, I think it's all gonna be okay. I just switched to this bag, and we're gonna find a brunch place for us. <laughs> we're just gonna, we're gonna figure it out. We might just end up going shopping and stuff, and then having to film today. I feel like we can literally just. Go eat, walk a little bit. I mean, it's literally raining. There's not much like yeah. we're gonna be able to do, but we can go look at shops and go shopping, and then we'll literally just come back, film, hang out. Yeah. I feel like that's what's gonna end up happening. Yeah, exactly. Like we're not. I'm definitely not getting like a full Nashville experience with this, so don't worry, everyone. I will be coming back, but I already love Nashville, and I'm realizing now when I left the place before you got here, I didn't even really vlog. So I'm gonna try to really up this vlog. 
But I feel like what people like watching anyways is just us hanging out, yeah. right? And like the thing fine. is, is like this is probably like the worst time absolutely in the history of ever to be traveling to a new city yes. and be like, let's explore because like everything is closed. Yes, so like we just can't really do that, but and yeah. it's pouring rain, so we're so just trying our best. Powerful. But this jacket is misguided. I wish I would have got it a size like down now, kind of. But it's just like really, I don't know. It's cute, so. <laughs> Still a fan. Anyways, I'm going to look up places to eat because we've already called like Muck and Honey and Biscuit Love and they're all like an hour wait time. So we might put our name in there. But if we do that, I just want to get a Starbucks. And there's a Starbucks on the corner by the Thompson. Okay, thank God. And then we'll get food. Okay, perfect. Perfect. We just need to get umbrellas. I need to know your current Starbucks order. Ooh, okay, I actually only have good ones because my best friend Maddie Trapp, who I can't believe you haven't met her. Okay, when you come to Dallas, we're gonna have a really great time. Um, I will tell you. Guys, today has really saved itself because I'm recording a podcast episode with Blair Fowler. So by association, I am to an icon. I was just telling Keen, I'm like, I recognize a legend when I see one, okay? Oh. So <laughs> um Anyways, we are recording today, which will be fun, and then we're gonna go see Sarah Bell's new house, which I'm really excited for, and then we're gonna come home, our favorite part of our day always, and film. So, yeah, look at Keaton's cute hat. She's really insecure about it, guys. I said she's so Nashville. I'm just not, I think this is maybe only the second hat I've ever owned. I, I don't wear hats either. Hat. Yeah. We are not hat people. Yeah. You know, I, I like, wanna become a black ball cap kind of gal though. Uh huh. Like, okay, let's get some today if we can. Yeah. That's our mission in Nashville. I just feel like I really could. It would really help me out because a lot of days I'm like super pissed about my hair and I'm like, I need to become a hat girl. Yeah. So, yeah. We just make life easier. It, it's okay. Yes. Okay, so at this point, yeah. I love them. Okay, I think they're cute. I look too long. I'm going to be disappointed. <laughs> <laughs> All right, well, we are out, guys. <laughs> We oh. found umbrellas. Wait, just go like this all the way. Is yours really broken? All the way up. <laughs> <laughs> Guys, it's really just been something. Should like I you walk don't... back in and talk to him? No, we just need one. <laughs> Here we go. I didn't even need one. I have a hat on. <laughs> Why did I buy it? <laughs> so we are like actually the like walking jokes of Nashville right now. I thought it's, that was a real bird. It's the tree. <laughs> You're gonna take me out. Guys, I don't even know where I put my phone. I hope it's in my purse. Like, this is really just. Been <laughs> we <laughs> Guys, we finally found these umbrellas and we're like talking to people. And for some reason, when I'm just in like a, like, just on one, I'm like, oh yeah, we're just invested. Like, I really just tell them our whole life story. <laughs> and they always think we're funny or they hate us. I feel like we have to explain ourselves. Yeah, because we're just like a lot. And. Explaining ourselves makes it worse. Anyways, blowing away. <laughs> Keen's gonna fly away with her umbrella. I feel like I have um, on maybe right. you'll make it to the rooftop bar of the Jobs in Nashville. <laughs> Guys, Keen and I like don't really go to bars, and that's like, we know that when you're 22 years old, everyone like that's what everyone like tells everyone you to go to. Recommending us rooftop bars. Which like obviously like we're down to go like whenever, but like we want like, oh my gosh no, no my my umbrella is breaking. <laughs> we want like cute other things, you know. Oh, okay. And we, it's also funny because like it's raining, so we for sure can't go to a rooftop bar, you know? So, anyways, we are heading off to Muck and Honey. This is my second morning at Muck and Honey. It's really cute. I'm excited. I haven't <laughs> Okay, guys, I just got my go-to Starbucks drink. You guys already know what it is. Comment down below the order. It just, it's a double shot over ice with coconut milk and toffee nut syrup. Then I had to get egg bites because we're not eating for another hour and I'm dying. <laughs> Let me show you what Keaton got, guys. Literally, look at this. She walks over. <laughs> <laughs> not even the chocolate one, the vanilla. I love vanilla like milk. Like I love vanilla flavored things. Yeah, I, I do know, too. I like vanilla egg, as well. Like, I need... You just needed it. I saw and it was the only one left, so it felt it, like... Yeah, it felt like it was meant to be, <laughs> obviously. What else would that mean? Hey, guys, Keaton actually just... <laughs> On my phone with the other stuff. Moody! <laughs> so I said this is team this weekend. No one's even gonna think we're funny. Like, <laughs> Guys, we have really sad news. So, Blair, it's very heartbreaking, but 
it's not that heartbreaking because I have to come back to Nashville anyways to record more. But Blair is not feeling great today, so obviously it is safer to like not do anything under the circumstances. So our recording isn't happening today, which is sad, but it's okay because we will eventually like record and stuff. So, anyways, our somehow our 80 minute wait for Muck and Honey turned into a 40 minute wait. So we're on our way back there right now. Oh, where are we wait, going? Where, I don't know. I'm, You're kind of right. It doesn't matter. Oh wait, no, it's on this side of the street. Yeah, yeah. I'm, no. So, anyways, we are going to go to Sarah's after we go to brunch, I think, and then just get some stuff done, guys. It's a really great. Kate and I were talking. We're like, with this whole like, we're probably gonna be on like lockdown type thing, like. It's not actually like relaxing for us. It's like, oh, we can just work more, you know? Yeah. So we will see. But yeah. Anyways, we love Blair. We wish her the best. We want her to feel better. I really hope she like the queen. Soon, that's yeah, I don't want to be sick during, during this time. time. It's like, obviously like not. Yeah. It's not that extreme, but like obviously you just have to be like so careful. So we finally made it to milk and honey i have some apple pear juice i just like love apple juice random fact i've been getting it at breakfast a lot lately and i got a black coffee even though i just got coffee i don't know why i did that and water we're gonna order some breakfast or brunch i guess it's 12 15 currently me and my casual three drinks <laughs> i am this person always She's really thirsty okay, yeah. Keaton got the protein bowl, which I got yesterday, and then this is the fig and prosciutto toast that sounds so incredibly amazing. So that was what I'm eating. We just made some emergency. We're back in our Airbnb. Keaton and I decided that we are going to record our episode right now, and then um, we're going to go to Sarah's to see her new house, which I'm so excited for. But I need, where did I even put those freaking headphones? I just keep getting everything messed up. Keaton is retaking her mood pick with our emergency. Guys, if we're not, if you feel like we're not taking this serious enough, just know that we deal with things through humor and we're not being ignorant. Well, it's like we just don't, yeah, it. so we're just like, haha, like trying to just like the best of it, you know? So anyways, we're going to record. Keaton, I'm going to show you how to use this. So oh, yeah, here's I a little a tutorial, really tutorial. We just finished filming, which, not filming, what am I trying to say? Okay, you know what? I think I can put this down here. Wow, the more you know. Okay, we just recorded an episode for my podcast that was with me and Keaton, and we did like an advice episode, which was really cute. Um, now we're actually gonna go to Sarah Bell's new house. I am so excited to see it. It's the Bell Glow on Instagram. Um, but yeah, we're gonna go over there, hang out a little bit, and then tonight we're probably gonna film. It's not raining as hard, but we are gonna like go to 12th South and stuff tomorrow, which will be really fun and then just hang. We're gonna film like a mukbang, mukbang, I don't know how you say it. Um, I just changed my jacket, so I'm just wearing this like cream coat from Misguided, um, and we're about to head off, which is gonna be really fun. Um, we've been working on different ways to put, you guys, like, you know when you put these bracelets on and it's actually hard to put on yourself? I have really just been like messing with mine and Keen showed me a trick. Um, so that's been really incredible, but the episode went really well. Um, I'll let you guys know, obviously, like, on Instagram and stuff when it goes up. Or you can just subscribe to the podcast. So, we are gonna head out to Sarah's right now, and I'm gonna call, yeah, Taylor, my producer. Do you love this gloss? Yeah, no, I literally love this gloss, but Taylor, my producer, just texted me to push my LA trip back in April. Literally, this is, like... Thank God I pre-record so much because like I am fine, but I thought I was gonna have like 20 episodes batched this month, wow. over the next month. So I have to still figure that out because I have to go to LA in April because my lease ends at the end of April. So like I have to move out. Yeah, you have to go. Like at the worst case scenario, which I don't wanna do, is I'm gonna literally have to hire someone to go through and pack all of my stuff, yeah. bring it to the storage unit, and then I'm gonna have to go there and then get rid of all of it. So we will see what happens but what a good angle this is guys brb that's what i have kinsey cute my wallet i'm probably oh <laughs> keaton like forgets her wallet everywhere so it's like this ongoing joke that um i'm mooching off with kinsey yeah she's just here for their, my wallet basically so okay copy address do you guys find or do you find that lyft or uber is cheaper in Dallas, Lyft is significantly cheaper, but in LA, like it's just different per city. It's very oh, yeah. odd. Wow, we're really getting out of the Golden Seymour of Nashville. This is East Nashville. 
<laughs> Casey Musgraves used to live in East Nashville, so I feel pretty cool. Or well, Uber's almost here, we have to go. Oh my gosh, we're literally in a blue Ford truck. This is our Uber. This is, this is perfect. perfect. We're on our way to Sarah's. Um, Keaton did my hair in the car, and if you watch our Instagram stories, you know what I realized? I didn't do my brows today. What? You could just walk out of the house and not have your brows today? No, I never, I just put gel in them, but I totally forgot. If I walked out of the house without my brows done, Kinsey, <laughs> <laughs> you would know. Well, it's just because I have dark hair. You would know. Like, I would literally know. What is your natural hair color? Dirty blonde? blonde. Yeah, like dirty blonde. You can see my roots like right now are like lighter. Getting there, yeah. Okay, um, so Keen did a great job and then I ended up having to fix it. <laughs> I'm honestly offended. I'm actually really good at the little like bear clip thing, but it was like really good. It didn't work out. We got I this really it. cute pick though, so like it ended up working out. Um just a working girl in Nash, you know? It is currently 7 p.m. We have been at the Bell Glow. I, for some reason, it's actually hard for me to say that for hours. We've been sitting on this couch literally probably for three hours. I think we've you guys covered here at like 2.30. We've literally <laughs> covered, we've literally we got a house tour and then we sat down and then we've just been talking for like hours and hours and hours. So I've been hanging with Miller. Oh, you're so cute. For your cheeseburger. Love the cheeseburger. What a good look. Um, yeah. Vegan. <laughs> it's vegan. Yeah, it's vegan. Um, anyways, Keen and I are about to leave. I literally cannot believe we've been here for this long. We really did get here at 2.30. Like, we've yeah. actually covered probably our entire life story and everything that it could possibly happen. We talked yeah. about conspiracies. Murders. Conspiracies. <laughs> I'm, like, telling you people Bill from high school what's mm -hmm. going on in their life. Like, it's getting real over here. We've yeah. My talk. engagement. Yeah, yeah Sarah's engagement. engagement. Everyone's going to be like, oh, my gosh, Sarah, you're engaged. Yeah, Coachella. Yeah, so uh, <laughs> you should, like, actually. Have you, like, told that story? No. So I think you should actually tell that. stories like this so people like understand how funny like Anyways, anyways, we're actually leaving and we're calling In food right now ordering food because we're gonna film a mukbang, but yeah, anyways great time Great chat guys. I can't get over there like I can so tell now that I realize that my, I didn't do my eyebrows today on accident oh. I feel like a different person so it's great guys. We are getting our takeout to film our um, mukbang Mukbang. How do you say it? It's mukbang. <laughs> but why do you? Pretty positive. It's mukbang. Okay, I'm gonna trust you. We got some food and sprites. For some reason, we really. Oh, that looks good. We really wanted sprites. So here we are. <laughs> All right, guys. We just filmed, which was fun. Um, I literally broke a wine glass because we were using it as our tripod, and my camera just like fell. I don't even know how that happened. But anyways, it is 8:40, which is uh right around our bedtime. So I think we're gonna get. Comfy and watch the what is the um oh the hiccups the Clinton affair we're gonna watch the Clinton affair we literally guys at Sarah Bell's we watched I don't know why I'm calling her Sarah Bell but like, like at Sarah's um we talked for hours and it was like so much fun it was like the per today was the perfect rainy day we were saying that earlier but we even got like cute food like takeout it was yeah. great um okay so we oh, talked for like hours literally about everything we we're talking about like. Um, president, like, scandals overall, um, conspiracy, conspiracy theories, we got Princess Diana, like, sh literally everything, relationships, like, literally we were talking for, like, hours, really took a really big turn, so anyways, um, tomorrow, it's not raining, so we're gonna go to 12 South, which will be fun, and then tomorrow night, I'm recording with two, I'm recording two episodes, I think, so, anyways, um, yeah, that's pretty much that. I'm gonna put my camera on the charger, so I'll talk to you guys in the morning. But today was fun. Hey everyone, happy Sunday. Um, we just got up, we got dressed, and we're getting ready. We are gonna head out soon-ish to 12th South today. Um, I have two recordings tonight. I'm recording with Hannah, and then Megan and Liz. And then I think we're gonna go to dinner with Sarah Bell and stuff after. So, that is the plan. Um, I'll show you guys what I'm wearing. This is kind of what I wore like the first day, but I didn't get a photo in it, so I'm wearing it again. Um, this misguided puffer. These are my favorite Levi's that I always wear, but like they're a little bit stretched out now. A white crop top, my favorite bag, and then just my Yeezys. I get a, need to get a new pair of everyday sneakers. I've really worn these out, but anyways, yeah, we're gonna head out, get some brunch, go to, what is it, Frothy Monkey? Frothy Monkey. The Frothy Monkey. Keen had a friend who was like, whatever you do, don't go to Frothy Monkey. And I woke up this morning and I was like, oh my gosh, there's a Frothy Monkey hat. 
Yeah. Troll South, so. Literally after I read that. Okay, yeah. I'm having a struggle. I don't have a top to match these pants, but I like these pants. The problem is. What top do you need? All right, guys, here's my outfit again. Different view. Um. Anyways, we're heading off. Our Uber is about to pick us up. Oh, I think our Uber might be here. All right, guys, I changed. I was like, I needed to do it. I just told, we went to New York and Chris, what? We went to New York in December and Keaton made me get this brush and it's changed my life. But anyways, um, now I'm wearing nude on nude. I forgot I had this top and this makes me feel a lot better about the outfit. We are now heading off. Yay. Hi. 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 We made it to Frothy Monkey. A lot of you guys told us we have to come here. So we are very excited. We made it to the Frothy Monkey. I got the turtle mocha or something. She got the monkey mocha. Um, they look amazing. This place is really popping. Um, yeah, everyone, literally everyone recommended this to us. So we're here and we got biscuits and gravy to be extra southern. We have our biscuits and gravy and our mocha. So we're very excited. I am actually like really cold. Who knew? Um, Keaton like wants it to be like literally wears hoodies in 90 degree weather. So I'm miserable. She's actually dying. Um, we just finished breakfast and now we're going into Outro Voices. It looks really cute. We're in Outro Voices. Keaton had no idea what Outro Voices even was. I just thought we were literally <laughs> living under a rock. Oh my gosh, that is so cute. It is so cute. Anyways, I want the sweats. These are really I mean, fun. I could wear it tomorrow. <laughs> Oh wait, so do we get these magic? No, I'm just kidding. <laughs> Enough. We literally <laughs> we, we get one get more thing. Magic. I know, it's the tragic. I kinda like the black though. But so I have the black. Okay, oh, they're you the have best sweats ever. Yes. I wear them all the time, the black and the gray. Are there other colors or is it? Guys, Keaton's literally trying to buy another one. Yeah, I get a green juice. Oh my gosh, I, I don't even have, have are those even good for you? No, I don't like I don't them. think that they are. <laughs> like be be the service. I go exposed. <laughs> Both. Guys, Ashley Tizzle and I are matching today, so I told her and I said, OMG, we're matching today. Just life updates. Okay, here's my drink. I'm gonna make Keaton try it because she hates strong drinks, aka anything that's not a vanilla sweet cold brew with extra vanilla. They're really not. Keaton, I'm trying my best to, it's not really doing much, so. Oh my god, look at your name. I know, always. Cute, comment down below if you saw it. Okay, oh, Keaton, let's see it. You can get a mint. No, it's for you. Okay, I want try you to it. taste mine too. I, Quincy gets this every day. I've tried it a billion times. It just tastes like milk. I'm offended. I used to hate it, but it's fine It now. does not taste like milk. June? Well, I like it. It's just like... Okay, I do, I will say, I love the top coffee in, in it. I knew you would like that I part. have it. At uh, my house, so I put that in my coffee every oh. morning. Starbucks sells it at Target. They have the toffee nut creamer you can buy. You're a genius. So I love the toffee nut flavor, and I put it in my hot coffee every morning. But I think that the strongness of that, like, was I the espresso shot. Like, Hi, can I have another dash of <laughs> milky poo? <laughs> oh, literally, King. We're going into Gucci and Louis and a bunch of stores, and Keaton's too embarrassed to vlog in there. I don't even think you can vlog in there. Anyways, we're at. I don't even know what this mall is called, but it's like the really cool mall that everyone loves here so we're gonna go shopping people are like actually staring at us now that we're vlogging but it's okay matching bags. matching bags actually i wouldn't put it past us keaton like doesn't even buy well here's the thing i buy nice things it's but fine. i always keep it is crushing and i <laughs> it's the one literally. time i want to spend money literally like, oh my god actually i'm out of a job no worries i literally buy <laughs> well here's the thing like my stuff that's nicer is always like I get like really like I buy it vintage or like I'll just somehow I stumble across. Yes. Like not like maybe not my, a good deal. Like I don't you know what I'm saying? All right, guys, we're back home. Um, I think we're just gonna be pretty much here for the rest of the night. We were gonna go get dinner with Sarah, but I'm just gonna see if she wants to come over here later. I have two podcast recordings, but you know, like this stuff. Can't you know talking about this? Like this, I don't know. As we've been in Nashville it's become way more serious. Not that the coronavirus was never serious, but like, I feel like no one was taking it seriously and then everything's come out as we were already here. So we're not trying to like cause- Downplay it. Yeah, we're not trying to downplay it or anything like that. So we're gonna be staying inside, which we mostly have done anyways. Yes, we were like, yeah, we like staying at home because we I feel like we were trying to, we, one, we do like staying at home. We were trying to not make it a big of a deal like on the vlog to like, I don't know, like to like, I don't know, freak people out. I feel like people are gonna want to watch vlogs to like, as like an escape type thing too. Yeah, to entertain you know, to like entertain them. them. So it's like we want to entertain you yeah. at the same time. Like we also don't believe. 
so yeah exactly so like we're not gonna leave the airbnb we don't want i just don't want this vlog to like be all about that and then you guys be like you can't escape you know what i'm saying but we really haven't even gone like we've been going to places for like a second if that which and now we're like just basically staying at home we leave tomorrow so i have to leave to go to megan and liz's tonight for like an hour and then i'm coming back and then um, we have to check out here tomorrow at 10 and then we'll figure it out. When we came here, like everything kind of came out literally like as we are arriving in Nashville as to how like serious we should be taking it. Because I know a lot of you guys were like, I mean all of us, like everyone was just kind of confused on like what's happening and like is it so serious. It literally feels like you're living in like some sort of simulation. And, and I don't mean it to like downplay, but like you just don't actually ever imagine this to like actually happen. It feels like you're in a movie. So anyways, we will be staying home um, until we leave, which obviously like flying is not ideal, but like we don't really have an option. So we are gonna try our absolute best and just, yeah. But that is that. Um, I think we're gonna watch The Clinton Affair and probably I might like start organizing my stuff to pack for tomorrow. Um, and then figure it out from there, but it's really been something. Okay guys, so we have now pretty much packed up everything just to get it organized for tomorrow. Um, this is gonna be my outfit for tomorrow, and this is like my carry-on and stuff. I still have my makeup and everything in there. Um, I need to post with some batteries for this mic, but we are home and staying here basically for the remainder of our trip. We have to check out at 10 a.m. tomorrow and then our flights are until like tomorrow afternoon night. Life. Guys, uh, yes, this is a weekend in the life vlog. Oh um, so Hannah's here, we're recording. We have our live audience, Keaton. <laughs> Thank you I so much. To yeah, it's gonna be absolutely incredible. So we're gonna record this podcast and we have food coming. It's incredible. So it is currently 7.07. .07. I need to be at Megan and Liz's in like 10, 20 minutes, but I'm a freak. So I'm figuring, I'm like making sure my audio is fine. So, this is what I'm taking. I'm going to call an Uber. Okay, I'm in sweats, a Snoop Dogg tee, this big coat to make it look like I tried a little bit harder, my normal bag, my like Fendi tote bag, and I am heading out. So the Uber is gonna be here very soon. All right guys, I just recorded an episode with Megan and Liz. We had the greatest time. We did. I'm about to leave and not tell them a story, so I have to go. I'm just using all of Keaton's stuff as a tripod. Okay, so I'm back from recording with Megan and Liz. I literally love them and I'm obsessed with them. So Keaton and I have decided that we're gonna fly out first thing in the morning just because we don't, like, tootaloo, we don't know like what's gonna happen and it's just our best case. Um, but I can just supposedly change my flight on American Airlines and that's not happening right now. So I'm just gonna go on Google Chrome and see and then if not, I'm just gonna buy a flight for the morning. Whatever, it's actually not that expensive anyways. I mean, it's literally $100 for a flight in the morning. <laughs> like, it's like, it's actually like the cheapest flight ever. Um, okay, do you have W? 7.19 a.m. I need to pack all my stuff. Like, I left like outfits out because I thought we were having like a day tomorrow and then now I'm like, okay, everything needs to be packed yeah. up tonight. And we need to go over the Airbnb rules and clean this place up. I don't remember her making this account. Can you imagine your security? question was your first concert like I literally don't know the answer to that okay not all of us got to be front row at Britney Spears when we were in kindergarten okay that's like sounds like your problem Keen, and not my problem that is so bizarre <sighs> no my uncle worked in radio I was telling this story tonight for some reason am I gonna list my uncle worked no, in radio yeah, so we did talk about this yeah. buying a flight it is guys uh all right guys good morning it is 5 40 we're about to leave to go to the airport <sighs> oh my gosh what a trip seriously what a trip with my 99 percent water huggies wipes that i bought <laughs> no way they literally i pick them up and i'm like these don't work like there's no lysol wipes or anything and then i read the packaging i feel like water. baby wipes yes they're oh. literally baby wipes but like it's better i guess like wipe it down than not i don't know yeah, guys, we're boarding our flight right now. We pay to sit together because we're really annoying. <laughs> it's fine. We are now on the plane. Yeah, please do. Um, anyways, so like I said, I'm flying to Dallas. We're both flying to Dallas right now. I think Keaton's continuing on to Portland. But yeah, we're just like excited I to be home. 
I just ready to be done flying, done traveling. Yeah. I'm lift this up for like five Here, seconds. do you want to put some more on again? Um, no. <laughs> I'm just gonna... We put some more like two minutes ago. I, yeah. I'm just gonna put a wipey. I feel so bad for flight attendants and stuff. I'm just gonna scrub her. <laughs> yeah. I mean, I'm sure that they wash them down now. But still, no. These days. But you never know. Simply this is me right now. The I'm and listening to you. We made off the flight. So happy for us. Well, Keaton has another. <laughs> what did you say? I'm vlogging. I'm like, we made it off the flight. So happy for us. And I was like, well, Bye. not Keaton, actually. Well, actually Thank you. Hey, Keaton's leaving. Bye, Bye. Keaton. I'm so glad well, we got to yeah. hang out. Airbnb. Hang in the Airbnb. It's actually our ideal weekend. Okay, I'll see yeah, you soon. Yeah, that was actually perfect. Yeah, I'll probably let's see you double like date this week <laughs> on FaceTime. On FaceTime. <laughs> perfect. In quarantine Literally. All right, bye. So that is it for today's or this weekend's vlog. Q just picked me up. I am going to start a new vlog right now, actually. So hope you guys enjoyed. Um, yeah, it was a crazy trip. We still just made the best of it. It was a good time. We're home safe I'm gonna go grocery shopping and not leave my house for could be weeks. You don't know guys, but love you. I'll talk to you guys soon